Some traders have continued selling banned monofilament fishing nets which have caused significant harm to the aquatic ecosystems. This has prompted the Minister of Fisheries and Livestock, Makozo Chikote, to act on the court order of August 24, 2023 to confiscate and destroy the 6,328 monofilament nets of different types and sizes found in the possession of traders at Kamala Trading Center. Today we are destroying illegal fishing gears confiscated from our traders in order to prevent the use of such gear in our fishery areas. The fishing gears prevented from reaching fishers are 6,328 monofilament nets of different types and sizes. The minister worked closely with the Zambia Revenue Authority, ZRA, in ending the importation of illegal fishing gears. I also instruct the Department of Fisheries to continue collaborating with Zambia Revenue Authority to collaborate in the right way. It will be a serious offense, especially if you hear that my staff from the department are the one engineering the sale of these illegal nets. And assistant director in the Department of Fisheries and Livestock, Evans Mutanuka, who ensure fishers use the correct fishing equipment. Our aim is to ensure that uh, people use the right nets, which are referred to as multi-filament nets. Mm -hmm. These particular nets are made from cotton and they are actually much more environmentally friendly in that once discarded, they are able to actually degrade. Meanwhile, Chilanga District Administration had this to say. I would like to urge that all fish traders in the district should adhere to the measures that have been put up by the Ministry of Fisheries and by the Department of Fisheries. You see, it's not a punishment. The measures have been put there to ensure that the correct way of fishing is done. I'm Chintumalambo reporting in Chilanga District, Lusaka Province.